something of a tradition for NASA spacecraft to snap a selfie when they get to wherever they're going. And InSight is no different. One of the first orders of business after landing on Mars was to take a rather awkward composite photo. See, like the Curiosity rover before it, InSight can't actually get its whole body in the frame in one shot. So instead, it has to take multiple pictures, in this case 11, and then stitch them all together. We're not gonna lie though, Curiosity's selfie was on point, and InSight could stand to learn a thing or two from its big sibling. Obviously, part of this exercise is about having fun and raising public interest in NASA and its mission. That said, there's some practical value too. All these photos give researchers a clear view of the area surrounding the lander, allowing them to gain some context about the environment. And it also serves as something of a remote physical inspection for InSight. Now scientists will examine the landing zone and decide where and how to deploy the various instruments and experiments on board. That includes a seismometer for detecting quakes, meteor impacts and dust storms, a probe for measuring heat flowing from the planet's interior, and a pair of antennas for measuring the wobble of the North Pole. All those will give us valuable information about Mars' interior and help us learn how it was formed. And since Mars is similar to Earth in many ways, it may end up teaching us something about our own planet too. We'll see you next week with more Engadget Today.